hi guys welcome back to my channel hope you all are doing great so for today's video we're going to be making our own hair conditioner and hair oil please consider subscribing and let's get into it So for today's video, we're going to be making our own at-home conditioner. I use Vertica hair oil, but you can use whichever that you prefer. And most importantly, we're going to be using out Moringa powder. So for those who don't know much about Moringa powder, it is a medicinal herb that has been used for centuries and has great benefits not only for the body, but also for the hair. Moringa powder has amazing medicinal values and health benefits. It has great benefits even for dry natural hair. It has large variety of rich minerals including zinc and antioxidants to help boost keratin production. Moringa powder also contains vitamin B, C, E, iron and omega-3 fatty acids which help nourish the hair, develop healthy cells and reduce hair loss. I mean, isn't that the most important thing we all need in our hair? I mean, who doesn't? So yeah, that's why I highly recommend you trying out Moringa powder and adding it in your deep conditioner. Not only are we going to be making hair conditioner, but also Moringa hair oil. Using Moringa oil as a treatment for your hair will make it dandruff free and moisturize both the scalp and hair strands. The oil hydrates, moisturizes and treats your hair follicles from the inside, which is why I highly recommend you infusing this in all your hair oils that you'll be using so this is step one making sure you have a nice watery consistency after adding in your hair oil and the moringa powder give it a good stir until you have a nice watery consistency Once you have a nice watery consistency, you can now let it sit overnight and strain it the next day. I highly prefer straining with a piece of cloth but not a sieve. You know I don't want to be having the moringa chunks into my hair. So that's why I highly recommend you finding an old piece of cloth somewhere that you ha you've never been using and all. And start straining and straining and straining all the oil. All, oh look at all that nice green oil that you are having. All that nice nutrition. All the vitamin A. All the vitamin. Mm, imagine all that in your hair. Like. Wow. As I said before, we're also going to be making our own hair oil. As it is, you can just take some little portion, put it on the side, and that is your hair oil. And then the remaining will proceed in making our hair conditioner. So let's go. Let's get it. So for the next step, we're going to be using our regular hair conditioner. I use Vertica hair conditioner, and we're going to be mixing that in good into the oil. You can use hair conditioner as it is, but I highly recommend you pimping your hair conditioner more by using Moringa in it. I mean, who doesn't want that? Having the Moringa powder in it, your hair oil and the conditioner. Mm, it's a very nice blend. You're going to love your hair. You can use this as your deep conditioner. I'm going to be using it as my deep conditioner, but you can use it as your leave-in tr treatment as well. But by using it as your leave-in treatment, you're supposed to put in little quantity in your hair, you know? If you don't want to rinse it off but if you want to use it as your deep in conditioner you're going to put a lot and then you'll rinse it off later so here is a sensitive information for getting very nice deep in conditioner mixture make sure you add in a lot of conditioner not we're not going to be economical here come on add all the conditioner that you have if you don't add in enough conditioner look 
this is what you're going to be having the oil does not combine with the conditioner and that is what we do not need we want it to be nicely mixed up together nice and soothy so that's why i'm saying add in more conditioner even if it means finishing up the bottle i mean we're making a hair conditioner so just finish the whole bottle <laughs> Keep adding more conditioner and more and more and more until it combines perfectly. And more, like more conditioner in it. Ay. With the simple steps i've given you and here you have it nice homemade condition i mean look at that mm, it's giving me avocado smoothie vibes but hey it's for the hair not for eating look at that wow So there you have it. I highly recommend you trying this moringa powder conditioner. It's really good for the hair, trust me. I'm going to be uploading soon a video of me trying this out. I'm going to be showing you my wash day routine me using this moringa powder for the first time. Make sure you subscribe to the channel and I'll see you in the next video. Bye guys, stay safe. I love you. Mwah.